Now it looks like it's working. There it is. Now we can finally start the game. I, I can turn my cursor off because it's not really necessary in the game. So this is stigmatized property. I have no idea what this is. And it's about going into a property. And there's a guy right here. You see him? He's on the very right there. Staring at staring at us. Oh, and that, that's, that's <coughs> oh God. There was a face on the lower left corner that I didn't notice. That kind of uh, startled me a bit. <laughs> I didn't notice right until right after I clicked. Anyway, uh, he invited me to his house. I wonder why. So, you, as you can imagine, this is a very film grainy retro style game, but it kind of is, it's kind of hard to see everything if I do that. Also, let me up the brightness so that it can be visible for the game, for everyone. It, it's pretty dark on my screen as well. There. You can see this okay, right? I hope this is the right way. Your friend could have given you directions, you know. Oh no. What's that? I'm not sure how loud this game will get. Oh, poor cat. Poor thing. Wow, this is actually pretty creepy. Like you're hearing these sounds like all around you, but you don't know where what's making that noise. I think that's I think uh, this game is playing on that kind of paranoia. So that's where the smell is coming from. A fish. He told me to be in the apartment room 104. Which one's 104? Frog. None of these are labeled. One oh four usually is downstairs, so it has to be one of these. Let me check back here. No. Oh. Those are nice looking apartments. I guess 104 has to be upstairs then. Yeah, none of these doors are working. Maybe I'm wrong. Knock on the door? Yes. Sumimasen! There really is no one. I can't just wait outside, I need to get in. Well? Um, yeah, did he say there's a spare key somewhere? I forgot where, though. Yeah, I was thinking that there would be a spare key somewhere. Um, knowing the usual... Oh, I remember now. It should be under a lemon tree pot. Perhaps I can enter from here. <laughs> um, is this a lemon tree pot? Wait, this is the lemon tree pot. I already checked under here. I already checked this. It didn't, wasn't interactable at first. Weird. Okay. Now lock the door. All right, she's being courteous to her friend who might come back later. Hiro?
wow, this room really looks really good for an apartment. I agree. This is a really clean apartment. My apartment is nothing compared to this one. What's this? I think I see something stuck inside the hole. Can I, can I get it? What's this? No, it won't let me uh, interact. It won't let me reach inside. I guess I need something to, to dig it out. I'm not sure if it's this kind of game though. Are? The last seven pages are torn. Interesting. So I need to find seven pages. I'm not sure um, if that means I have to find it to unlock the... What the? <laughs> I'm controlling the, the movement. <laughs> Can I use this hook? This hook that I'm waving around right now. Uh, yes. Yes, use the hook. I found one. April 4th. Moving is over at last, and today marks the first day living alone, and also the first day writing a journal. I really look forward to the experience. I've always dreamed of it. I decided to move here because the rent is very cheap. I honestly can't believe that a broke student like me can afford such a nice room. Plus, it's really close to my school. How amazing is that? I ate out with my parents today to celebrate the move, and they were both laughing and just having a great time. Living alone is great and all, but man, I'm going to miss those faces. They told me that they're going to be here for only a couple of days. They kept telling me how worried they are, but they're just overthinking. They don't have to worry about a thing. I'm going to do just fine. Probably until something terrible happens. Like some kind of J-horror things. Uh-oh. A J-horror is happening right now. No reflection in the mirror. Plot twist. I am actually a vampire. Here to drain the blood of my friend. I can't even see in here. It's so dark. The paper's wet. I need to find a way to dry it. Should be easy. Um, be a hair dryer somewhere maybe. Um, let's see. I should, it should still be in the bathroom. Here we go. All right. I was. You've seen this, right? Second plot twist. This is actually a portal to a mirror realm where you'll be stuck and, f stuck and trapped forever. Uh, okay, that's, that's actually more creepy than the game itself. <laughs> April 5th. Today I took the whole day just setting everything up in the room. What used to be a room with small luggage and a simple bed now became a room with a bunch of furniture and a whopping queen-size bed. The previous tenant left everything and the owner was too lazy to get rid of them. Dad seemed to like this house so badly, he said he'd like to stay a little longer, but as much as I appreciate their company, I'd like to live life already. The owner came to say hello today. He looked like he could use a little sleep though. What was wrong with him? He shook my hand with a big smile on his face. Told me how grateful he was for someone to finally rent the room, but how he stopped smiling right when he left my right after oh sorry. He stopped smiling right when he let my hand go. That was way too weird. Anyways, the new semester starts tomorrow. Gotta get ready. So there's gotta be a reason why the rent's so cheap. All right. 
Uh, I need to look around a little more. I'm telling you, mirror universe. Look through the hole? Sure. I'm sure nothing terrible will happen if I look through the hole. There's something in there. I think that's my clue for the next page. I don't think I I don't think I find all the seven pages here. Yeah. There's nothing else interactable here. Let's go outside. On Psychothon, I'm fine. Let's stay inside. Let's go to the fridge. Let's let's have some snacks. Let's let's go. Let's rest on the bed. Let's lock the door behind me. Jesus Christ. We're already getting to the horror, huh? I'm I'm very sure that it wasn't red at the time. All right. Oh, hello. Oh, you have a page. I'm going to need to ask you to hand me hand that over. My god, the noises. All right, so I can't do anything about it. I probably need to give him something. Oh, hey. Knock on the window? Sure. Hello? Are you okay? Why is he just standing there? Oh, okay. Thank you. I'm turning down my volume a bit. I have no idea if there's going to be any kind of yelling. Apartment memo. <clears throat> this apartment cannot be demolished. I tried to call a contractor trying to destroy it, but for some reason, the phone line keeps stops working. My mother suddenly becomes ill. I hope it isn't related. The local priest will not come. I tried asking other people to ask the priest. The priest got into an accident and died. Talismans are useless. I bought a box of talismans that stuck and stuck them on my walls, but they were all burned the next day. Whenever I put a talisman on a wall, the word curse will continue to appear in my head. The apartment does not catch fire. The building repels fire. The apartment must continue to sell. A resident will be chosen every month. The chosen one will be possessed in a week. And after the possession, the person completely disappears from this world. And no one remembers a thing about the person. Keep having nightmares. And a strange voice keeps telling me to bring human. I can't sell the apartment. I can't let them hurt my family. Someone please help me. Okay. I'm going to turn around. There better not be something at the window or behind me. What's this? All right, we're good. We're fine. Third page. I, I think I left this apartment open. That was my bad. April 6th. Today was the first day of the semester. It's good to see my boys again. I They wanted to come to see my new apartment, but I don't know. They better not fuck anything, any, anything up. Mashima sensei is my homeroom teacher. I wonder what kind of teacher she is. I hope she's not mean like the previous one. That guy was an asshole. Another weird thing happened today. 
When I got out of the room this morning, some middle-aged ladies across the street gathered and talked bad about this apartment. Women of that age like to gossip a lot. It's probably whatever. I'm slowly turning around so I don't get surprised. <sighs> okay, okay. I, I gotta stop being so paranoid. Alright, so I already checked back here. That, that back there is fine. Oh! Fifty yen. Hmm, that's odd. I see a crumpled paper in one of the slots. It says it costs a hundred yen. I need to find some change. Shouldn't be too hard. Isn't this his mother's car? Looks like his mother came to visit, but I guess they went out? What was that? Oh, I made a mistake! I'm sorry! I didn't mean to intrude! I'm sorry! I'm sorry! This place is empty. What? What in the world? This, this was a room. Didn't have things in it? I'm so confused. Um... Okay. I'm not sure what to do with this. I guess I'll just keep it around for now. I can't interact with anything now, though. I probably need to use this for something, so I probably have to put it down somewhere. Alright, no problem. Uh, let, I'll just look around. Maybe I'm supposed to reach something. Let's look back in here. Doesn't look like I can put it down anywhere. Oh, there we go. I can get in here now. Right? Uh, climb through the window? Sure. That sounds like an excellent idea. Going into a person's house. Found it. I can go right back out. Let's go. Andale. Oh. Oh, this is his bathroom. <laughs> Whoops. I don't know what I was thinking. April 7th. I said hello to my fellow neighbors today. The polite thing to do, right? Always be nice to your neighbors, right, Mom? But you know what, Mom? I don't think that works here, because I got the cold shoulders from them. When I said good morning to the neighbor on the right, he just stared at me with his big eyes, and without a word from his mouth, he shut the door on me. Even now, his big cat-like eyes won't leave my head. <sighs> I shouldn't be so rude. 
I'd probably give it another go some other time. Anyways, today I saw a girl who looked just like the girl in Shikibara, Shibakibara 89 in my class. Her name's Mira, and I'd like to get to know her. And from what I heard, she's single ready to, she's single and ready to mingle. Oh man, you're a player, dude. How lucky. I'm excited for tomorrow. Okay. So that's four out of seven. I still need some money. There was an item down this way. Oh, it's the key to the car. There we go. Okie dokie. Back inside. This is why you should always lock the door. I am I will not dare to look at that mirror. April 8th. Mom came over to my room again. I told her she doesn't have to come anymore. I think she had a fight with dad again. Her passive aggressive attitude got to me, so I asked her how dad is doing. She refused to talk about it and instead just sat there quietly. I've never seen her like this before. She would usually put a fake smile on her face after a fight. I would notice that. But it just wasn't like at that this time. An hour or so later, she regained her usual positivity when she asked me if I can invite my old-time friend Say uh, Sayaka. She had the biggest smile when I agreed to it. Mom must be worried for me to live alone still. I only have Mira-chan in mind right now, though. Hmm. But that smile... Her eyes weren't smiling. Okay, slowly. Slowly. All right, we're good. I'm not looking in that mirror. It's gonna be like a, a a spook. Be like, oh, I was, I'm right behind you, but not really. All right, let's do it. Come on, show me the scare. No. All right, they are courteous to me right now. They're being, they're being very nice to me right now. So I need, I need a little more money. Which means I have to go down these alleyways. Pick up the fish. But why though? Look, money. <laughs> Shit, dude. Okay, what is this for? Oh, I have an idea. I bet it's. I'll come back to you in a bit. Um, I bet this is for the bird. I bet it's for the bird. Yep. Pescatarian achievement unlocked. Thank you. Thank you. I'm not looking through that hole. <laughs> Fuck that. Fuck that shit. April 9th. I was able to talk to Mir Chen today. What a great day. Except for one thing. Mom was gone when I woke up this morning. 
Her car was still packed here, and it's odd for her to leave without notice. I hope Dad picked her up or something because the car is still there. I invited Sayaka today and said she'd come tomorrow. I hope this makes her happy again. All right, fine, I'll look through the hole. This is the worst idea. I'm, cl I'm, I'm gonna squint my eyes. And okay, yep, red room, got it. Red room, best room, got it. All right, I still need to find 20 more yen to get the crumpled paper. I bet I can look like grab it from like some leftover cash if I look hard enough. Oh wait, the um the guy that slammed the door. Maybe he maybe he can give me some money. Oh he did! Thank you, kind sir. Which means I'm only left with ten more yen to go. I do not like to be down alleyways at night. All right, last one. Cat's gone. Cat has disappeared. <sighs> we're, we're getting close to the scare. We're getting close to the spoops right now. This is gonna happen. I'm re okay. Psych yourself up. Uh, whatever comes at you, whatever jumps in your face, it's gonna happen. I'm ready. Do it. There is no escape. Can't read the rest. I'll call him later. I need to get home. Uh, oh great, look through the peephole? Sure. I would love to do that. Here we go. I got the possessed ending. Good for me. Good for me. <laughs> Thank you for that. Um yeah, uh, exactly the kind of a uh, game I expected. And even even when I was ready for it, I wasn't ready for it at the same time. Love it. <laughs> so there's obviously a different ending, probably a way to save her friend. Or maybe a way to escape. I don't know exactly how to do that, though. But uh, that's something for for someone else to find out. The next one is called Okari, and the uh, the cover has a anime schoolgirl, but it's going to be all first person. I like how <laughs> I like how a lot of these games is just someone putting in a uh, like putting in a tape. Uh, 
Here we go. There we go. Okay, Ree. Let's go down that alleyway again. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna work so hard to get like the best endings in the game in these games. Um. Again, the brightness. The brightness is okay. The film grain makes it hard for everyone to see. So here we go. I'm not sure. I think this game is a bit shorter than the other one, though. So. Oh, you. You and your absent mindedness will get you into trouble. Or killed. Whichever one is. Whichever one you think it is. Now, I'm not sure if these, um. If these, uh, J Horrors are, like, original stories made by the developer. Or if it's. Uh, like an like a like an actual story from some urban legend. I think part of it. I think there's like uh, some of, some of their games is. I don't think it's this way. But I went the wrong way. I've already lost the game. I'm already getting get the bad ending. The one thing I'm I'm not enjoying right now is the fact that I can't sprint. So that means that no one's going to try to chase me and I run away. But at the same time, the pace makes it a bit slow and sluggish. So that's the one that's that's one complaint I have right now. A lot of Chillus art games can be rather slow paced. Um, but I gotta say, it ramps up. When it ramps up, it ramps up hard. Like, you don't see it coming. Ooh, what's this? Did I find a secret? Do I get a special ending for this? No? Is this just for show? Okay. I get you. Oh boy. Am I home now? Is this home? I guess I went the right way, and I'm supposed to interact with something. Let's go back here. I think this might have been the right way. This door stands out to me. I just saw the E on the door. So this is obviously the right way. And there we go. We're good. Oh my goodness. Um, I just noticed huge frame drops. Was that from the last game? All right, let me know if it keeps happening. I might need to restart the stream if it happens. I'm back. Oh yeah, it's, uh, is it going up? I think I know what the problem is, but that requires me to restart the stream. If that happens, I might restart the stream if uh, once this game ends or once uh, if the if the frame drops end up being too much. Yeah, I wasn't notified of frame rate drops, though. Yes, please. I'd like to go much slower than I usually am.
Mom? Mom? Huh! Maybe it's just me. Oops. God, it's so slow. Somebody left their coffee on the coffee table. Recently, mom wasn't feeling so well. Oh no. It's already been one week since mom and I moved here. Oh no, it's the apartment thing again. After a, after a week, they get possessed. Red light. Usually that means that the stove's been used recently and that the surface is hot. That probably isn't the case for that. All right. Can I turn on the light? It's pretty dark. All right, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Mammy, are you here? Why can I go in here? Oh, I can't. Never mind. Mm. Weird. supposed to find something here but I don't see it maybe I just look around until something happens up oh, here we go when was the last time I watched the TV okay Nice little commentary. Can I turn on the TV? No. Alright, there might be something else somewhere. No. Here we go. Stray cat. Neko chan. cat doing in here seriously what's a straight cat doing in the basket hmm oh wait here we go. I should clean up. I should clean this up soon. <sighs> okay. Cool. Uh, any other commentary? Maybe if I come out here, something will happen. The hell was that? Upstairs. E. Mother, is that you? I told you not to bang on the doors again. It got dark. Oh, good. Good. I. Mm. I love it when things get dark. Why am I doing this to myself? I'm, I'm the kind of guy who gets scared easily in horror games. And psychological horror games are like my biggest weakness. Mommy! 
Mom, you're home. Please fix the lights. I don't know how to do it. Bathroom. Two. Two? Two. 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 I'm fine. I'm fine now. Uh, the best ending is the one where I leave. <laughs> and never return. God damn it. Alright. Mom, look what you've done to the place. I know you're going for the feng shui type of uh, cleaning, but this is too much. Seven. Two, seven. Something tells me I need to remember these. Came from the closet. I'm gonna look around though. God, you know this is paranormal when they even nailed the boxes down. All right, two seven. And of course, mom is gone. Two seven nine. Two seven nine. That's probably the last of it. But what does that mean? Oh. The noise came from this. Oh, that was me. Oh boy. Oh boy. This is nice. This is very nice. Um, let me just make sure. Oh! You go into this room. It looks like I can go into different rooms now. Um, this door was open, so I think this room is free. Maybe. Mm, nothing much here. Oh, wait, here we go. 2797. 2797. I don't know if that's the correct order, but um, I'm just going in the order that I see them. Two seven nine seven two seven nine seven. There's probably a bunch of different combinations to that. I'm hearing noises. Of course, I hear noises. There's a, there's a thing I can interact here. Four. Two, seven, nine, seven, four. Oh boy. Looking around. All right, let's, let's do this. 
Kettle, toilet, tatami storage, my room. Oh, this is the order. Um, tatami. Storage, my room. I don't think I'm going to remember this. Um, I need a, I need to set up a note. So it was kettle. What was it? Kettle, toilet, to Tommy storage in my room. Kettle, toilet, to Tommy storage in my room. Kettle, toilet, to Tommy storage in my room. All right. Kettle, toilet, to Tommy storage in my room. All right. So I know that. Uh, this is not the storage. This is, what is this? Um, I know Tatami is downstairs. Oh wait, kettle. Okay, so this is a, this is a kettle, this thing right here. So that would be four, toilet was two. Um, this might be my room. This might be my room, and then this might be the, the uh, no, wait, this might be the, my room. No, uh, there, there was no numbers in here. So that's my room. So it's kettle. God, I should, I should write these down. Four, two. What was the Tommy? Four, two. Seven. Yeah, four, two, something, seven, seven. I'm going to hit these in order. Just to be safe, four, two. The Tommy is actually, I think the Tommy is, um, is in here, right? Four, two, nine, seven, seven. Is that it? It's either four, two, nine, seven, seven, or four, two, seven, nine, seven. Either way, I need to know what, the, what it's used for. There's probably a code I need to put in. Probably, yeah, there's probably something I need to open with that code. Let's look around a bit. Actually, I should write this down too. Four two nine seven seven. I'll I'll keep that combination with me. So uh, once uh, once I find where I need to put it in. Should show up somewhere. Maybe in here. No. Where is it? Hmm. I checked up here, so it has to be downstairs. Check 
the walls. I just have to look for anything that has an E on it. Hmm. Keep looking. God, the pacing so slow. Um, I'm running out of options here. I think what I need to do actually is, I maybe I do have to hit each of the uh numbers. Maybe I actually have to interact with each of them in order. I don't think it's the numbers I have to memorize. I think it has to be the... Uh... That's what I'm thinking, at least. Oh, wait, here we go. E, please. Oh, great. Okay. So it was like four, two, and then here's the last three. It was it's either 977 or 797. We'll start with uh, 977. There we go. Is this a dead? Space exclamation mark. The hell? Mom! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, I don't want to show that so much. Shit! What's happening? The frame's not skipping, so something is happening. Are you alive? Please be alive. Oh, no, it's not. She's not alive. Oh, God. What am I doing? What am I gonna do? Oh. What am I supposed to do? I don't know what to do. Am I supposed to interact? No. I'm trying not to show it too much because that's that's an awful gruesome scene. I'm so glad I put the adult audience on. All right. It's a bit noisy. I'm turning it down in case there's like a big noise. What's happening? I think I need to do something here. Can't interact with anything. Oh, here we go. I was supposed to read this. A bit noisy, isn't it? But um, it, I, I'm sure the uh, the sound effect will end soon. Four hours later.
Oh no. It's not over yet, but um what is she doing out here? This has to be some kind of urban legend that's happening or something. I don't know. these noises. Oh no, are you kidding me? Time to walk away. Is this how it ends? Really? Videotape 7 12 01 132 AM Achievement Unlocked. I did not see this coming. This is definitely a shock. Um Oh god, okay. Alright, we get it, it's the end. Just move go come go back to the uh Go back to the beginning, thank you. Oh my god. Um, I'm not sure how to react to that. I don't know if I should be sorry for <laughs> streaming something like that or just, uh, or just be shocked. I mean, it's supposed to be like a horror game. I get it. I just didn't expect that kind of a, that kind of thing. It's a psychological horror, so I should be prepared for that. That was my fault. Um... Anyway, it's, uh, that was okay. I gotta say, uh, yeah, chill is art. Like I said, once it, once, uh, once it picks up, it really picks up hard. What you expect is not really what will happen sometimes at most times. Uh, okay. For this case. Yeah. I did not expect that to happen. I thought it was going to be a lot more paranormal. But uh, I guess that wasn't the case. Just a really hor horrifying story. Um, in the in the in the aspect of of horror, yeah, that that really spooked me. That really kept me su in suspense. The one thing I really hate about it, though, is the pacing. Uh, when I say pacing, I mean like it's really slow up until the midpoint. And let's and also the just the walking speed is is pretty uh is pretty bad too. I'd like to be able to speed up a bit if I can. Cause that was it was just sluggish. But yeah, that was okay, Ree. Happy days. Let's let's all let's all be happy now. <laughs> I wanna be happy. Um uh, but of course we're playing horror games. How am I supposed to be happy right now? Uh, this is the last one of the pack, and it'll be the last game of the night. I'm sorry that it has to be cut short, but um, I did start out late. Uh, these games tend to be 30 to 45 minutes long, and I plan to do carrion, but that's probably going to be the next time I stream because of how late it is. So let's uh let's start this up. It looks like the frames aren't dropping at all. So that might have been something from uh Kill It With Fire stream. But yeah, if it ever shoots up again, I'll uh I'll be informed. Um yeah, it seems fine. Please wait while the game is trying to load up. There we go. I'm not hearing anything. Oh, that's because I uh, transitioned out. 
I'm not hearing anything actually. Is that supposed to happen? Or is that, I think that's me, hold on. Yeah, that's me, it's ambient noise. All right, so this is Inukaki, uh, Inunka, Inunta, Inunaki Tunnel. Sorry for the mispronunciation. Um, from what I understand, this this might be an actual urban legend in Japanese horror. I'm not sure. But here we are in the in the tunnel. The night's the night. I have to do this. It's the only way I'd ever get famous. Of course, let us go into something completely, uh, let's go into, let's go into a place that could be potentially dangerous. Um, let's turn off camera effects because I need to see. Everyone needs to see. Uh, so let's see. Gonna... Flashlight F, sprint shift, drop Q. Left mouse button for action, right mouse button for zoom. Pretty uh, decent controls. Um, decent, not decent, like usual controls. I didn't know about drop though. That might be this part of the game. There we go. Yeah, we're not running. We're not running VCR recording anymore. We're in the digital age now. It's too tough for me to climb over. Camcorner may activate its face detection on anything with a strong spiritual energy. Interesting. Anyway, uh, I love the fact that I have a face <laughs> in front of me. That's very nice of it. Um, there's gotta be something. Maybe there's a way for me to go through the cracks. No? Oh, that's nice. All right, so there's gotta be something for me to use to climb over. Exit? Yep. Achievement unlocked, chickened out. <laughs> Alright guys, speedrun tactics. Speedrun tactics, you can beat the game just by leaving. I can't, um... I can't, I can't get out. I think the game froze on me. Oh god, this is really loud. Sorry about that. I had to exit the game. Anyway, I got an achievement for that called Chicken Doubt. So there are different, very uh, many different endings. So that's nice to know. Um, we're going to not do that again. We're going to start the game. All right, let's try this again. This is the only clue I have. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe there's a maybe there's a way around it. I just have to look for it. Oh, here it is. I'll be back for you. I feel that you're going to be useful. Let's go. I'm sure nothing bad will happen if I have you. while you stare at me with those dead eyes. Hmm. 
Oh god. Um the noises are coming out pretty strong here. Yeah, the sound effects are really bad here. Can I turn that down? Like maybe to this? That should be good. All right, we're good, we're fine. Okay, I'm not detecting anything on my spectro vision. A black dragon appeared in this village 2,000 years ago from the sky. The black dragon attacked the village with its flames. People prayed to the relentless dragon every day and hoped that it'll calm down. Then, the dragon was having a ritual at the body of a man who had just died recently trying to possess his body. The villagers gathered together and captured the dragon and sealed it under a sacred stone. And the dog was placed to protect the stone. That's what I heard from the elderly man. The old man said that it was a story passed down by many generations. Only a few believe it to this day. But he explained the blood of the guard dog still runs in some of the dogs that wander in this village. Interesting story. Uh, interesting story, but uh, is this the only thing in the tunnel? Wait a minute. When did I run into this? Eh, whatever. Let's go this way. Nothing of value here. Hmm. I feel like I'm going around in circles now. I want to scratch my nose, but I feel like if I do, something will happen. Where am I? Okay, so we have two directions here. We can continue going down this darker path or go towards the light path. I think it would be more interesting to watch something in the light. So let's go this way. Looks like I made the right choice here. This. Some broken, broken, oh, it's a part of a car. How the hell did it get here? This is interesting. I could use this to clear up the path. I need the key. Oh, you know, just any random old bulldozer in the sewer. I mean, come on. I mean, it's totally normal in this part of the sewer. It's an old bulldozer. Why not? All right, I, the key should be, might be nearby. So I just gotta look around. Oh, 
what's that? I heard a noise. I do not like the noise. Oh, I thought that was something. It's detecting something over here. That's probably the construction worker. That's not good. There's something up in that tree. Oh, oh, I was scared of my doll for like a second. All right, how am I going to get you? You like right there, like right there. No, yeah, it says it's right there. Anyway, um, this guy should have a key. I don't see it anywhere though. Looks like something used to be here. Maybe I can fix it? Yeah, pull the ring. Man, these things can be easily missed. I might have opened the uh, the front here. Here we go. Another crane. The dog at Shir the dog at Shiraisi's house seems to be attracted to the sacred stone. The dog will chase down anyone who approaches the stone, and one even came back with his calf muscle completely pulled apart. Even when Shirai Shiraishi tried to put it on a chained leash, it always manages to break it. Oh, that's not good. I went near that stone. What was that? Oh, it was an earthquake, apparently. Well, uh, it's been a good run, doll, but uh, I believe I have other matters to attend to, so why don't you watch over the body here? Thank you. And I'm going to run away because I feel like something's going to chase me. No? All right. So I bet if I went near the stone now, I would have been chased. So I'm glad I didn't do that. I want to dive more into this, this story. Well, you know, just a normal, uh, probably high school, maybe college student working heavy machinery, you know, usual shit. I'm guessing if I managed to fix that stone back there, I would have had a different ending, but we're just going to go straight ahead. This is not the night for me to think. This is the night for me to be spooked. Oh! Okay, thank you. No. Oh. Mats Matsuda isn't thinking well about the dog at Shirashi's. Shirashi is thinking about expanding the land, but the sacred stone seems to be in the way. Matsuda knew that the dog will get in the way 
of anyone that will try to remove the stone. He tried talking to Shirashi persistently, but he loved his dog so much that he refused to listen to Matsuda. I wonder what this is based off of. I'm not sure. This seems like to not be an original story. This has to be some kind of urban legend. I heard a noise. Is that behind me? Hmm. Can't see too well. Nice textures. Oh, that, oh, that's this, this. This has to be the sacred stone. Oh no, this is a graveyard. It's a graveyard. Nakamura, 1966. Oh wait, these are... Are these gravestones or are these monuments? Kobayashi, 1942. Saito, 1987. These don't seem like gravestones. Maybe they are. Yamamoto, 1974. Suzuki, 1991. What is this? Watanabe, 1956. 1957. Sato, 1990. Ito, 1940. Hey, Sato has returned from missing children. What are you? What about you? What are you? Found a. a looks like a doll. The first person here drowned by the hour. The last person was burned alive by the minute. What? Drowned by the hour, burned alive by the minute. So burned by the hour, so it has to be an hour. I probably have to set it to an hour exactly. I have no idea what this is. The cursed clock? Achievement unlocked? I did something. Takahashi. Oh, Takahashi's here. Recently, Shirashi's dog started barking more aggressively and persistently. Matsuda had decided to move the stone on its own. When Matsuda tried to finally remove the stone, the dog barked and would not stop. Matsuda was unable to hold his anger and stabbed the dog multiple times with a spear. Hearing the dog cry was unbearable. When Shirashi found that his dog was gone, he was filled with rage. Matsuda moved the stone regardless. So I fixed the clock uh, by sheer luck. I knew it had to be on an hour mark, but I didn't know which one. So I have this thing. Can I use this? Oh, I can. Oh, look at, okay. So maybe I get a good ending if I found all of the hidden stones, statues. Should I go back and look for it? I'm interested now, I wanna know more. You have piqued my interest game. I 
I know this might take a while, but bear with me. I sh I'm not that far from the uh, from where I last was. Of course, there was a truck over back uh, when it. Of course, there was a car that drove away, but I'm sure it's not going to come back. See what I did there? I did some foreshadowing. I bet it's going to happen. I'm going to ru run back to where that last statue thing was, and I'm going to get run over. Just watch. No? No, I appear to be fine. Good. All right. I think I know what happened. So that thing in the tree that I saw had to be the stone statue because it was because I didn't understood I didn't understand why my uh my spirit thing was focused on one of the branches but now I know it's because it was up there and the earthquake shook it down it had to so let's uh let's look back up here again and we're going to get it Now that I know that the dog is not going to kill me, uh, we're going to be fine. Oh, okay. It detected it. Like right here. Where do you see it? It might be inside. Yeah, here it is. Found you. You are going right where you belong. There we go. Which means you, my friend, are coming back with me. You have to play some role. You you can't be just some tutorial thing. You have spirit. You have spiritual energy in you. You must be important. All right. So that's two so far. And we've reached 20 minutes and 35 seconds with this playthrough. Very good. But we, we are going to keep going. There's the bus. We already read there. So we can go past this part now because we've already solved the puzzle. Oh, um, I didn't check this house though. Want to know what was here? No, there was nothing. All right, let's move on. We've already done what we needed. me 
Okay, I'm going to turn around. And there better not be a little girl behind me. There might not be any loud noises. I'm turning down my volume here. You can't scare me, game. How do I get out? Um, hello? I can't get out. What's happening? Oh! The handprint. At least I hope it's just the handprint. Oh. I'm going off the beaten path for a second because I'm interested in what's over here. A river. No, that's a, this is a sewer. You know what? I, I don't even know anymore if this is a sewer or not. <laughs> this is all weird. Doesn't seem like there's anything here. Let's keep going. I doubt that they're gonna hide like secret stones in this part of the woods. Or in this part of the game. There's something in the van door stuck. Okay, I need something to wedge it out then. Do I have to look around? What was that? Don't be doing... Jump scares at me. My little body is not ready for this. By the way, if you think that there's, that there's no noises happening, you're right. But don't worry, you only have to pay attention to the big noises that happen. Uh, like what you heard just now with the footsteps. Those come out pretty loud. The ambient noises do not. Part of the river is pretty loud. I don't seem to find anything that can help. Maybe if I follow the river. And now I'm lost. I'm lost. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to find something. Maybe I can find the road again. Oh, here it is. There you here. Here we go. This must be the thing that helps me open the car. Okay, don't know why it rocked, but it did. An axe. Hmm. I 
bet it's to make a, uh, a bridge. Maybe it's to cut you. Let's, uh, let's look around. Here we go. Bridge created. Pretty sure I don't need that axe anymore. But if I do, I'll, I can always come back to it. Look around the, the spooky forest and the sewer a bit. Was that? Is that a dog? Uh oh. All right. So another stone. Maybe I can find it. That's probably where I need to go next, but I'm going to look up here first. Oh no, this is the... is this the way forward? There's the gong. There's nothing to hit the gong with. Let's read this. I don't know what happened, but now before me, all I see is a desolated village with black clouds above us. Many known faces have fallen. I'm alive, with blood coming out of my feet. I must write record this. I must write record this. I must write, I'm going to say I must write a record of this before it's too late. It's getting darker and darker. My vision is hazy, but isn't that where Matsuda killed the dog? I see a silhouette in the darkness. Is that hu human? No, that's... The rest is covered in blood. Shit. Oh, there is a monster here. All right. Let's keep a close eye on where this last stone would be. Come on, spirit vision. Show me the way. What is this? It looks like I need to light something. The bucket? There's a lot of things here that are missing. I'm guessing I need to find them somewhere either out in the open or somewhere nearby the landmarks. Let's look around a bit. I'm going to inspect this area first. Here we go. I see. I'm just putting things back in its proper place. How about I leave you near the well? At least I know where you are. Um, is this something? No? Yeah, I need something for that. A rope. A shovel and a map. Have you ever heard of a woman named Mitsuko? I heard her voice. 
I know you won't believe me, but just do as I say. Listen, she must be the one who keeps knocking down the Jizo statues. She hates them to death. I buried one next to the shortest stone lamp, so she won't find it. I will tell you where I hid the second one later. Make sure to dig them up when you find the rest. All right, shortest stone lamp. We're getting that. I, this has to be the last one, so let's... Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Okay, where... The shortest stone lamp. So it has to be one of these things. Shortest stone lamp. This might be it. No? You are not the Sword of Stone Lamp. I don't believe you. I'll find you. Maybe I need to read it again. Is it, did it say near the short stone, stone lamp or next to it? Let me read you again. I can't read it again. All I know is that it's near the shortest lamp. So it has to be around here. Oh, there's two of them. I just realized that. Oh, I better not go forward. Where? What's happening here? I should have found it by now. Oh, I found it. All right, I'm gonna leave it here because here's the thing. Um, it said, do not place it until you find the rest, which means I have to find the one that belongs to this one first. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm going to go back and grab the ax. I think the axe might play a role in this. Usually when you use up items, they disappear, which means that there's still a use for that axe. And that use might be somewhere nearby. That's the pattern I'm getting in this game. I'll grab you. So I, I think the idea is that I have to pay attention to the trees. I either have to pay attention to the trees near the river or the trees somewhere in the middle of the forest. Oh my god, there's another one? Oh no! Up the dog? Yes. Up dog. Hi dog. Are you okay?
I'm gonna follow the dog here. Maybe he'll find something for me. What is it? Someone there? Growled at something. What are you gonna do? This is this might take a while for us. Going near the wall. There has to be something here. Found something. What'd you find? On my way home, I heard a man shout, so I looked where it came from. I see five young men pummeling an old man to the ground, whom I have seen in, in Inunaki village with a cane. I heard the guys talk about their frustrations in the village. The old man shouted, If you're going to hate, hate yourself for being one of the residents of Inunaki. If I went and tried to help, I thought I'd be beaten too. I ran away. I couldn't bear to watch. A little later, smoke started to rise at the place of the violence. A neighbor said some outsiders came and ignited a house with gasoline. I was worried about the old man and tried to go to the place, but I was too late. It was on fire and I couldn't get close. I was later informed that the guy found in the house was indeed the old man I saw earlier. It's my fault. I couldn't do anything to stop it. No, it's space. It's their fault. The villagers got hurt because of their selfishness. I don't trust the outsiders. I will never forgive them. All right. So this is, I'm gonna pick this up. Should be easy to get over back over there because it's right here. All right, that's three. Now the fourth one is still at large, and then after that I can use the one near the near the lantern near the stone lamp. It has to be near the trees. So this is probably the second to last one. Oh! That makes four. All right, last one. Boom. Saint, achievement unlocked. I did it. You're still coming with me, but I still need to uh, put you back up. Uh -huh. Let's solve the rest of the riddles first. All right. This obviously goes to the bucket. didn't tie it itself to the bucket.
What's going on here? It's not doing anything. I can't click on anything. Let me put this back down. Yeah, it's not doing anything. I guess that's just how it is. Unless I'm supposed to hit something else in here. No, that's it. That's how it is. Maybe if I do something else, something will happen. Oh, that's the way up. Let's look around here first. Make sure I'm not missing anything. No? Got everything here. I got the rope. So all that's left is banging this gong. Great Buddha spell. Seems to be missing a log used to ring it. You mean this one? <laughs> uh huh. What's this thing? The crank for the well. Of course. Of course. I need a crank for the well. Goes here. Use the well? Yes. And there's a lighter. Now, I don't think there's an order in which to light these, so I'm just going to light them. That doesn't seem creepy at all. I hope I don't need that lighter for later. But yeah, something definitely happened up here. We're definitely near the end. What's going to happen? We're back in the tunnel. What's that mean? What does that mean? I am <laughs> I'm getting a bit uh getting a bit nervous. We're out. We're almost out of the tunnel. What? We're about to exit. Yeah. Call the police? Sure. I'll call the police, please. Police should come any minute now. Wonder if I should stay here. Or should I just walk? Yeah, I think I should just walk. Maybe if I go this way, they'll fu they'll spot me. No, they don't want me to go that way. Let's go this way. No, can't go there either. Go in the middle of the street where they can run me over? Here they come.
Hey. Uh, mission, mission complete. I did it. Yay. Is something supposed to happen? I've finally done it. I've successfully recorded the infamous Inunaki Tauj. Tauj. I did not care what happened to me back there. My mind was occupied by the excitement of being the first ever to record the entirety of what's beyond the tunnel of Inunaki. However, tonight I am utterly disappointed. This can't be. The recording was swapped with a video recorded by a girl I've never seen or ever heard of. The video was very odd. Show me the tape. Show me the tape. At first, the girl seemed very cheery and happy, but the video would cut here and there without a reason. And every time that happened, the girl seemed to grow more and more pale, almost translucent. Maybe because of the shift in lighting? The poor image quality of the video? This is madness. I must get back and record it again before the place is completely blocked. Are we going back? Good ending. Result recording su successful. Oh, all right. Uh, that was Inunaki Tunnel. I guess uh, getting the good ending happens when you get all of the saint statues on their little pedestal. I'm glad I actually went back and did that. Um, I'm sure something creepy would have happened if I actually, uh, if I actually uh, didn't do that and just did the puzzles. In any case, it was a nice little, it was a nice game. It kind of reminded me of Missing Children. Nice story-driven narrative. Uh, I had a good time. Um, I probably, I probably not going to go and find the bad ending. Oh, there's a secret ending too. Well, you know what? I'll leave that to everyone else that's played this game or people that want to play this game. I don't think I want to look it up. Anyway, um... I think that's going to do it for the night. I started a bit late. It's 11.03, and work is going to start tomorrow. So I will be back uh, with some playthroughs coming up. A one in particular, Carrion, is coming out, uh, has already came out. I have not started yet, and I wanted to start it for a while now. So if you're interested in that, stay tuned. I'll be back with that as well as maybe another playthrough, or a quick look at least. So until then, if you stop by, thank you for stopping by. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you all later.